with six months in my term, we produced a, our framework for artificial intelligence. And we were the first university in the country to come out with its framework. Let me just cite to you a few examples. Our AI principles, they have 10. But let me just focus on several key principles, which is transparency, accountability, safety, and most importantly, meaningful human control. So why do we study fish? Basically for two reasons. No? Resilience, we need to know what is there for resilience and we need to know how much is there for uh, food security. So AI was developed as a semi-automated fish census which not only identifies the type of species there are, counts them automatically, and even tells you the biomass. Where AI would come in is, for example, flagging to us uh, illnesses that are bound are happening because now when you go online, we can track if everybody's coming in for the same reason. Now, as AI technologies continue to evolve and get integrated into our society, having an AI-savvy workforce with the needed skills and knowledge become essential for maintaining competitiveness in the global market. And therefore, we need to prepare our students for this. So you use AI uh, on these star maps and it can more efficiently and quickly calculate the position of the satellite based on interpretation of these maps of constellations and stars. So a simple program that can monitor their activities, whether they're standing, sitting, will help support them in their everyday life. And at the same time, fault detection will be able to detect emergencies and will be able to send help. We want to create a community, and that is you, who will advance AI in a service of the nation.